I'm going to show you how to make a really good intro using FilePress. This service lets you, um, they have some free, some that you have to pay for, but the templates are really good. A lot of my Minecraft uh, intros are from this company. I just did um, how to make your own server using MC Pro Hosting, and I did that intro with this program. If you um, and and they and um, they you can download them to your computer right here. You can upload them to YouTube right from this menu. Um, I will preview this so you can see it. So, how do I make that? That's a good question. I'm going to do a video on that right now. So, pretty much, you are going to do an order. So, what you could do is go to, let's see. I'm probably going to go all the way up to the top. Um, my account, maybe? Yeah, that's my account, or in my account. So if you go to um, template, uh, this template thing here, they have some that are free, some are, are not. And, they, and you can get like a little demo of it as well. And then you got the, this kind of one. Some have pictures, you can add pictures to it. And again, some you have to pay for. Um, here's that intro for my live streaming. And you can add music to them as well. Um, we're going to make one that is for this one. As you notice, it's pretty simple. So we're going to say customize it now. And then this is where you have to enter in and the color and all that kind of stuff. So you got two lines with this one. So we are going to, hopefully, if I can paste this in, but I can't. Um, so this one is going to be how to, uh, to use. And then the bottom, we're going to put what we're using. Um, this program is very easy to use. So it's, and you just got to type in what you want to say, and then that's it. How to use, bang, and then why not use red? Now down, and you can preview it, which we will, we'll put it in 720 because that's pretty good. And then down here you have the audio. You hit that and you can pick the audio you want. They have lots of choices here. So we're going to... So, and then they got promo. I mean, they got so many good sounds. And again, you can use these. That's the one I have. We got which is um, we got shorter ones. What's this? I mean, there's so many choices that you have. Here. Dance. I mean, there's so many good choices here. Let's see what this is. You got, um, like I said, there's just so many. Um, got classical. Do, 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 do. Let's see, what, what's this? Ah, uh, nah, that, that's. So, I mean, there's so many, uh, choices. You got sympathy. Let's see. Hmm. What would be good for this one? Hmm. Oh, I like this one. So when you when you found the music that you like, you just bring it over to the program that you're using, 
and then you just slide it in, and then you hit select. Then, um, it won't, this is like a preview of how Using you use Flix it. Using FlixPress basic templates is really easy, and I'll show and that, you. And that's how, you, if you need help, they have a video right there for you, and then you're going to hit render right here. What that's going to do is it's going to render a copy of what it will look like. And they'll show you an email, your email account that you provide when you sign up. I didn't go over how to sign up. It's basically you fill out a form and you're good. So we're going to hit, we're going to hit the X here. We're going to go back to um, my account. And then you'll see right here, this should be the new one. No. So it hasn't processed yet. Are my previews being used under there? Okay, so. So then, okay, this must be it. No, not. It must be this one. Yeah, so there it is. How to use Blink. So you can see how you can really make this really interesting on how you do it. And again, this is just a preview. And then, like you said, you're going to go back and hit edit. I should put .com. And then again, you can change the music up. You can have different colors. I mean, there's so many colors you can make. It. You can make it blue. You can make it green. That kind of looks nice. I like the red for right now. So then when you're all done, you're going to hit preview render again. And then you're going to hit this X again. And then it's going to be this one. Oh. Do it yet? Hold on. So you might have to refresh the page a few times. Um, so let's see. Now I'm gonna do it. Yeah. So now, how to use this program? Perfect, right? So th there's your logo right there. Then you're just gonna hit place the order, and it's gonna place the order. It says, dude, do you want to submit it? Remember, you can't change it, so you can hit OK. And now it's going to ask you to make that order for the video. So then, when you go to my orders, it should... It might take a minute for it to show up, but eventually it will show up in your order one. Um... No, not yet. It hasn't showed up yet. And again, you'll get emails and, and all that kind of stuff when they are ordering and all that. Let's see. There's that. Alright. Alright, this has not anything to do with them. Alright, you might order. Alright, I think I did it twice. Oh well. So then you got this right here. So that's how you make the intro and out, or what kind of, and then you just download it in HD. And then you can also download in the full HD as well. Because after a day, it does delete the videos from your account, so you don't get to keep them forever. Um, so I would just download them. So yeah, I mean that's all you have to do for that. I mean it's very simple to uh, make those. So I'm gonna have to say, um, I mean that's it. I mean that's pretty much how you use this program. You can make as many intros as you want. And um, you can download them, you know. So, um, like I said, there are, you can pay for it, but why not use the free one? It's very simple. You saw how I made those those two right there. And um, as I normally say in my, in my videos, I'm going to have to say, bye bye for.